Hello. Hey guys. Another day on the homestead. Yeah, a busy one. So we were tagged by clueless homesteaders in a collaboration titled Dear Younger Me. And um, I'm going to let him go first. What would you tell a dear young, a, a younger version of you? Not to hurry so much. And then enjoy life the way God gives it to you. But you still got to get out there. I wish I would have done this when we had the children. Done what? Uh, more of a debt-free, build a cabin, and not be scared to get out of the box. I mean, although we did homestead, we rent it, and that's all wasted money. Uh, so I would have said, you know, look at things a little bit closer. Mm -hmm. um, take your time, because when you don't take your time, you make a lot of mistakes. Costly ones and emotional, emotional ones. And... Uh, other than that, I think I would do everything the same. I, I don't think I've done anything I haven't done, wanted to do. Yeah. It's just a little later in life than I wish I would have done earlier. Yeah. Even though, what, we've been homesteading now for... 26 years? 26 years, yeah. Yeah, 26 years. Right. So I think for me, what would I tell myself, a younger version? I'm like him. I'm really satisfied with... Um, the choices that we made, I don't really have any regrets. Um, other than, as he said, the whole debt-free lifestyle. And um, that's not because I didn't want to. It's because, you know, we had a fear. I've always wanted to turn four walls and a roof into a home. Um, at the time, I didn't know that that would look like a shed. But that was always my goal, was to be debt-free. Um, so I would tell myself to just go ahead and do it, to eliminate the fear of what other people thought, of what, other you know, could, yeah. and, and of what, like, what could happen, like the what could, you know, what if we did do this? I wish I would have just done the debt-free thing a lot sooner. Um, other than that, like, yeah, I don't really have a lot of regrets. Um, so this is kind of silly. But what I would tell the younger me is to buy dessert first always when you go out to dinner. Really? Yeah. I mean, that's the first thing I look at when we go to a restaurant. I look at the dessert menu. And I get really excited over the dessert menu. But then we eat dinner, and I never eat the dessert. And I would tell the younger me to eat the dessert first. I would tell... You can always take the leftovers home. Yeah. I would tell the younger me to... To slow down, enjoy life. And when I was younger, and even still today, my... It was work, 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 work. Yeah, work was important. And, you know, I never slowed down sometimes to, and I missed some of the things my daughters did growing up because I was there, but I wasn't there. Yeah. It's so work less I, and... Work less, enjoy your family. You only got one walk through this life. And, you know, take your time, enjoy every moment of it. And, uh, <laughs> and you know, make the best of it. You know, you're going to have up and downs. Sorry, guys. What are they doing? They're being ornery. Uh, You'd have uh, up, up and downs, but that's, that's, that's how that's life. life. So that's it. You that's know, I don't it. think we really have very many regrets. Um, just, you know, don't be afraid to do the debt-free thing, no matter what that looks like to other people, um, a lot sooner. And it doesn't matter how big your property is or what. If you can be debt-free... You've Do already it. got a kit, you yeah, know, you yeah, know yeah. when you can... Debt free is, is huge. Yeah. So that's the biggest thing. Um, I guess we should go take care of babies because they're being yeah. quite ornery over there. And all the sheep are yelling for me yeah, to Yeah, they're starting to come time. down. So anyhow, time for chores, which we're going to slow down and enjoy. And um, that's it. So, oh, we have, we're tagging three other channels in this. Um, we're tagging Out of Goshen and... Um, the Stivers Homestead and Ession's Homestead. And um, we look forward to seeing what they have to say. What would you tell the younger version of you? Um, what would your advice be to yourself? So I'm going to link those three channels down below. Now we were tagged by Clueless Homesteaders. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put them down below too. So go check out all those channels. There's so many channels out there with so much 
you know, great advice and things happening on their own little homestead. So we're going to go do the chores and we'll see you guys later.